This looks like the place they were talking about. Morning, sunshine. Hope we didn't wake you. Kurva. Did you have to sneak up on me like thieves? We are thieves. Besides, we had to make sure you weren't followed. Why trying to lead us into a trap? But enough of this chit chat. Let's get down to business. We heard there was some trouble at the monastery. Question is, was it the right sort? Did you do that job we agreed? Do you think I'd be sitting here if I didn't do it? How should I know? The world's full of idiots. It's done. You've got proof? He had this on him. Hmm. Aye. That says all right. What did you do with the body? I left it where it was. What else could I do? So, they lose a monk and find a corpse. How long do you reckon it'll take them to put two and two together? Well, it's not like I was planning to make a career in Rome. Hmm. Fair enough. Soon it won't matter anyway. What now? What now? You did your job. But what do you need people like me to do? <laughs> I'm just a crimp. All I do is recruit. Where? Are you seriously telling me you didn't know it's the camp? Not too observant, are you? There's a hill above Sassau. And on top, there's an old abandoned fort. Only it's not as abandoned as it used to be. That's where the camp is. Go there and report to a fellow by the name of Eric. Tell him Kozliak sent you. And they'll let me in just like that. Good point. I almost forgot. At the gate, show them the special die you took off Pius. That's our sign. That's all? That's all. You'll learn everything you need to know at Vranik.
Stop grouping. What's, What's going, going on? For you? Orders of his lord. Whatever you're being paid. Satisfied? That's not in. Off you go. Sir, I have news, and I'm sorry to say it's nothing good. After everything that's happened, you have even worse news. That's almost impressive. I'm afraid so. It's going to happen again, and on an even bigger scale. You're full of good cheer, aren't you? What exactly will happen? It seems the Pribislavitz encampment was just the start, and they're far from defeated. How did you find out? I found a recruiting agent who worked for them, and let him recruit me. Ah! God's holy hat! You never cease to surprise me, lad. And what did you find out? They have another much bigger encampment in Vranik near to Sasau. What do those bastards want? And who the hell are they? To hurt us? Conquer the region? I'm not sure yet, but I can find out. How? I'm one of them now. I have their secret sign. I know where their camp is. All I have to do is go and take a look. That's out of the question. It's too risky. Sire, compared to everything I went through to get this, it will be child's play. I already passed their test. They trust me. Then we'll have to attack them before things get out of hand. Ideally, right now, when they're not expecting us. Once we catch that mangy little shit, we can ask him nicely what he wants. But then again, before we attack, it would be useful to have a spy go and scout out how many of them there are and what they're up to. I don't want you to take any unnecessary risks. It's much less risky than our raid on Pribislavitz. All right then, Hal. Go there and find out how many of them there are, and what their plans are, whatever you can. Yes, sir. Godspeed, lad. Hmm.
Yeah! Yeah! What do you want? Let me inside. Inside, eh? I came here for a game. Show me that. Aye. All right. Thank you for your kind welcome, comrade. Eric. That was easy. Now I better... I'm so hungry I could eat my food. How did you end up? You know how it goes. So when I heard they... I'm giving you the chance to win it back. Those tents look pretty impressive. These fellows aren't paupers, that's for sure. Killing, fighting, never losing, robbing, fucking whores and boozing. Not only strong outer walls, but inner ones too. This must be where the commanders are. What do you want? Kozlik sent me. Ah, more reinforcements. You're the one from the monastery? Yes, sir. So you really killed that turncoat? Yes, sir. Well done. I heard about you, and quite honestly, I didn't think you'd succeed. Yes, I know what I'm doing. Well, I think it's best if we put you to the test. Just go downhill. As far as the stockade. All right, sir. Are you Combat Master Vanya? <laughs> Aye, that's me. I'm Henry. Ah, another Greenhorn. Nice to see Kozlik's doing his job. Hey, don't I know you from somewhere? You look familiar. Yes, you taught me sword fighting in Skalitz. Wait. Yes, I do remember. We met at the alehouse. 
All right, let's see what you're good for. Ready as I'll ever be. All right, let's see what you're made of. I'll slaughter you. your balls. Get what for? Uh, 
I tell you we're gonna fight here. We can't go crashing around the camp. Most of the fuckers here, lad. Well done. I've had a bit of practice. So I see. I'll tell Eric what you've got in you. Don't worry about that. But so you don't think old Vanyak is past it, I'll teach you one trick you'll be glad to know. Oh, that's very generous of you. Well, I don't want to take it to the grave with me. All right, listen. Before you start twisting and turning, Take a good firm stance with your legs wide apart, like this. As if you're about to let off a huge fart. I think I've got it. Thanks.
Sir, may I... What is it? I went to the fight master as you ordered, and I... What's the matter? Lost your tongue? I think I know what's troubling the young master. He's surprised to see me here. And the feeling's mutual. When did you start recruiting Radzik's people, Eric? Radzik? Indeed. This boy is very dear to him. And I expect he's looking for this? Am I right, young man? You bastard. <laughs> He's coming round. I apologize for the discomfort, but it's for your own safety. And ours, of course. You can count yourself lucky, lad. I'm going to keep you alive. I'm sure your father will pay a nice fat ransom for you. My father's dead. That lucky of yours wouldn't even let me bury him. He doesn't know, Eric. Nobody told him. He told me, a foreigner, but not him. How very inconsiderate. I'm sure you'd rather hear it under different circumstances and from someone else, boy. But beggars can't be choosers. Your father, your real father, is alive. You even know him. It's your liege lord, Radzik Kobela. Although, how much can he really care about you? Here you are, a homeless orphan, and he still hasn't acknowledged you. Your parents are both dead, aren't they? I thought so. And yet, Radzik still hasn't told you the truth. Could it be that he's ashamed of you? Hmm. I wonder if you'll want to pay that ransom after all. Well, best not think about that. If your father won't pay your ransom, you have no value to me. My father's dead. I understand why you feel that way. My own childhood was not dissimilar. How strange that we should have something in common. But I've delayed long enough. Now it's time for you to tell me why you came here. I was looking for my father's sword, which was stolen by a certain bastard. And I found it. But I wonder which father you mean. In a way, it belongs to both. It doesn't matter who it belongs to. I'm going to kill you with it. You're hardly in a position to threaten me. But now I think of it, why not? When your father, your real father, pays, I'll give you an opportunity to try. I think that's very generous of you. Isn't it? <laughs> Radzik will crush you, and I'll be there to see it. I very much doubt it. You spied in our camp. You must realize that your father hasn't a fraction of the forces I've gathered. And now, with the king in captivity, there's no one to levy troops to come to your aid. Even united with Hanush and Divish, your father couldn't raise more men than I have. The only force in this country capable of defeating me is Sigismund's. And he pays me. When he wins, I win. Everything I take now will be mine. And I plan to take everything. So meet the new lord of the realm. A man like you will never rule here. Have you never heard of Lord Sokol of Lamberg? Or Sahinek, the dry devil. They fought for your king and plundered the estates of the lords in Austria, just as I'm doing here. Like they say, the stronger dog fucks the bitches. <sighs> and war is a nasty business. Sir, it's time. Now, I'm afraid I have more important business to attend to. I'll leave Udo here to keep you company. <laughs> and let's hope for both our sakes that your father pays up. Farewell. Rotten hell! <laughs> Knock some manners into him, Udo. Come on, Eric, let's go. We've got work to do. Henry. Henry. Wake up. Can you hear me? 
Jesus, that brute really worked you over. Here. Try to drink. I thought you'd never come round. How do you know my name? Don't you recognize me? It's Vishek. You fucking traitor. You throw me to those bastards and then look me in the eye like nothing shh, happened. Shh, be quiet. Maybe we started off on the wrong foot. But I'm your only chance to get out of here alive. So do you want my help or not? What do you want? I want to get you out of here. But if you'd rather, I can leave you to rot and get the shit kicked out of you by Istvan's bruiser. So what exactly are your reasons? Nothing you need to care about. But I do care. I don't believe a word you say. Not a day passes without these cutthroats pulling daggers on each other. And I'm the youngest, so they make a slave out of me. A bandit's life isn't quite how you imagined it, eh? Look, I just want to live a normal life. My help won't cost you a tenth of what Istvan would want from Sir Ratzik. What about my possessions? Eric has your things. Oh, wonderful. It'd be better if you wore something to blend in, it's true. But I can't go and get you anything. How do you propose to do it? Finally, we're getting somewhere. I know a way you can get out of the fortress without anyone seeing you. I'll wait for you outside. Afterwards, you'll tell your noble father I helped you so they don't hang me. Risk? Not really. What are they going to do with you if they catch you? They want to ransom you, so the worst they'll do is lock you up again. All right, then. Let's get out of here. That's what I want to hear. But first, swear you'll tell Sir Ratzik I helped you. You have my word. All right. I'll have to trust your man of honor. Now listen, I found a place where you can easily get out. The pile of shit reaches almost to the top of the stockade. Free and covered in shit. So that's all? Well, first, you both have to get there. We can't let anyone see either of us. I'm supposed to be guarding you and you're... Well... I'm supposed to be guarding you. There shouldn't be anyone outside in front of the barn. I'll wait for you not far from the camp, by the dead tree between the path and the brook. Out. Where could he have vanished to? He must be here Is that somewhere. all you've got? Mother of God. Well now, look what's come crawling out. What? You're in the wrong place.
What's that?
Hey, crawling out from under some rock. Who's there? Yeah. I can't stand any more of this. You're gonna cry now. Is that all you got? Ow! Get him weak at the knees. Pig turns up willing for the sword. What's going on? Come here, Lily Liver. What's that? Who are you? Jesus, what a fucking stink. I can't stink. <laughs> 